Can I create animation for you? Today I'm testing Cloud 3.7 Sona to see how well it generates motion graphics. Just from test, I will start with a simple Figma logo, experiment with smooth motion, crazy effect, and even nail glue, all without traditional animation software. Does it work? Let's see what I can do. Let's make a very quick tutorial today because yesterday Cloud launched Sona 3.5 and many people say that it is a very good AI model for coding. I will test it to make some animations, so you will be able to see how to play with animations, but not as the traditional way that you enter to a software, open the software, how to move the sliders and that things. You just ask the AI to create the animation for you. I take the logo on Figma and start to play with it. I did some tests before, you can see them here. I paste this simple prompt, take this Figma SVG logo and animate it. The last frame must be the logo. So, and here I paste the SVG. If you don't know how to do it, it's very simple. You just go to Figma, click on the right button in the mouse, and here you copy paste, you select copy as a SVG. It will copy the code of the SVG. So here are the results. I'll click on refresh, and as you can see, there is very interesting animation that comes here. But the next thing I ask the AI to do is to make it more smooth. Very simple prompt, only four words. Let's see how it looks. You can see that it's a little bit more smooth. The next step was to ask it to make a crazy version. Here's the text. I write it with a lot of misspelling, but doesn't matter because it will understand me. I click here and you can see here that there are much more movement in the screen. It also has some drop shadows. I didn't like it so much to be honest, but okay. Next thing I ask it to add a logo bricks effect and you can see it here. It's add the bricks and then the logo Figma above. I didn't like it so much. I thought that it will convert the shapes to rectangles or something like that. But uh, okay, this is what we have now. Then I went to ChatGPT and ask it to give me some ideas of animation. Here's the page from ChatGPT. I just write very simple prompt, give me ideas on how I made the logo. And it gives me some idea, stroke rival, morphing. Let's take this one and see what it's give for us. Okay, we have now a new chat with Claude. I paste the prompt, take this Figma SVG logo and animate it based on the guide. I have the guide here and I ask it that the last frame will be the logo. Let's run it to see the results. Okay, it's add some interface here. Let's click on pay animation. And you can see that's quite nice to be honest for one prompt. I mean, cool, cool one. Let's do another one, the last one, and try to do another style. I open the new chat, paste the information, I ask it to create glowing neon effect with the logo. Same prompt, just the style change. Let's see what it will give us. Okay, it's finished. Let's see the animation. Quite nice, I must to say, for one point to get this one, very easy. So this is for that tutorial. I finished with this tutorial the 30 days of uploading video every day to YouTube and LinkedIn. And I try to make a little bit of automation to make the process more smooth. And then I will continue to upload video. Let's see if I will be able to do it every day during more time. And if you like the videos I uploaded and you want to ask something, just drop a comment because it's helped me to understand what you want to see and the things you want to study. Thanks so much for watching. If you are looking for a product designer to level up your business or you're curious about bringing AI into your workflow, my contact info down in the description. Feel free to reach out anytime. And if you got value from this video, don't forget to like, subscribe and drop comments. I would love to hear your thoughts or any questions you have got. See you in the next video. Take care.